Alright guys, what's up? It's Nelly Nice here, and today I'm going to be showing you, uh, for my Christmas special, uh, not really special, but, um, because today I finally got, uh, the Lego, uh, Star Wars, not Lego, the Star Wars 41st, uh, Elite Clone Trooper figure, action figure. So, yeah, here it is, and really, I was really excited to get it, pretty nice, um, it's a very nice figure, uh, I, re I really do like it. So here it is. Uh, very nice. I'll show the articulation. So yeah, he's got. You can move it, arms forward. Uh, bend them at the elbow. Turn it, and turn it at. Turn it over here too. Oh, whoops. And you can also. Ah, I'm sorry. I'm recording on my iPod. This is bulky case on. So, so, yeah, and then you could also turn the uh, hand, bring, get bend out the leg, turn it like that, and then bend at the knee. For some reason, this one doesn't really bend. Uh, I feel like I'm gonna break it when I do. Uh, it's kind of stiff, and it also pivots at the foot. You can bend it down and forward and turn it. Uh, and at this foot also, it also and at the foot too, it also feels like it's gonna break. And the head, uh, it can kind of turn it, but that's only because it take off the helmet and you get turn it. I get it with the actual head can turn. Very nice. So I actually got the clone trooper head, and it actually did remind me, it looks like one of the heads that came with one of my other figures, uh, it came with, uh, this blue clone trooper, uh, from the original Clone Wars, uh, series, when they, like, right when, uh, General Grievous was fighting, uh, like, the five Jedi, and then they, and then he, uh, they, they had, like, the arc troopers come to rescue them, one of them had, like, the, like, that blue mask. It looks sort of like an airborne, except it didn't have like the tubes at the sides, like how these had the tubes. The airborne has that. Uh, the airborne trooper. I don't remember what it's called. And then he had like the, he was blue, and then he had like these uh four cannons. Uh, he had like the four cannon thing on his um uh, on his chest. I don't remember, but you, if you could search it up, and um you could search up for the scene. I know some people put up the entire uh the entire uh for uh season um it was on I think season two in the, in the first episode of season two. Yeah, so and then they come to rescue them. So yeah, actually and one of the and one of the troopers had the same head. But yeah, very nice. And it turned and yeah, these are accessories, the helmet and the D C I think it's the I believe it's the D C fifteen blaster, I don't know. Um I really don't remember. And he put it back in his hand. So like you can't really hold it because the way his fingers are bent. You can't like, like how on some of the clones you actually they can like hold it at like here. They can grip onto it like that. He can't hold it because the way his fingers are bent. So yeah, they kind of get in the way and you can't really grip onto it. So that what's that's what sucks. Um. And so yeah, but it's a very nice clone. And here it is, I'm going to do a comparison. Oh, actually, I just want to say something. What's weird, though, what's weird about him is that um, he's a 41st Elite. So, um, he's supposed to have gray shoulder pads. But for some reason, mine don't. Uh, so, I searched it up on my my surface, my window surface. Uh, I'll show So, yeah, if you, as you could see, if you could zoom in that picture, you actually see that they have, they have gray shoulder pads, which is something mine, for some reason, doesn't. I don't know why. That's weird. Oh, and I, uh, yeah, you see, he has white ones. And I also noticed he doesn't have those, uh, those lines out there. So, yeah. And, uh, I just did. So, it's kind of weird. Uh, 
Yeah, that's kind of weird about mine. Uh, yeah, I don't know why he doesn't have the gray shoulder pads unless they made like a printing error or uh, they just didn't make it like that. They just made it without them. I don't know why, but yeah, it's weird. And so yeah, for comparison, here he is with something else I got today. Uh, the Mission Series uh, four, uh, 501st Elite. Uh, 501st Trooper uh, from the Mission Series. It's like a two pack. So, yeah. And he has a bigger helmet than his. You actually see. Um. I'm gonna take this. If you look at it, this one, he has a, he has a shorter mouth. A shorter tube. Uh, he has longer, um, uh, visor. And, uh, He's the best of the helmet. The actual helmet is bigger. It's like a lot wider. Of course, because he has to put the head on. Well, it looks weird because that is not like the black part from his neck thing up. Just like that. And so, yeah, there he is with the 501st Trooper. I couldn't take his helmet off since it doesn't come off. And here he is with uh, the Mission Series Anakin, which also which came with the 501st Trooper. So, yeah, he's kind of bigger, I think. No, actually, he's smaller for some reason. Which is weird, because that's not really size accurate. But, yeah. So, there is the uh, 501st Elite Trooper. I hope you guys like this review. And I'll see you guys next time to review the two ones you just saw. The 501st Trooper. The 501st and Anakin. I'll review them next time. So, yeah. So I hope you like. I hope you guys like that. And I will see you next time. So goodbye.